Welcome to June's Leaco Challenge. Today's problem is insert delete get random in O of one time. Design a data structure that supports insert, remove, and get random in an average of one, O of one time. Normally with this problem, you're supposed to use a combination of a dictionary and list. The dictionary is gonna track the index number of this value inside of the list, and that's gonna allow us to do an insert and remove in O of one time. And you can use a, the random module to uh, select one of those values inside of the list. So you could do that, but I found that Python 3 allows you to just use the dictionary. Luckily, the dictionary has been really updated a lot. So I'm just going to set um, an object called items, and that's going to be a dictionary. So here we want to do an insert and insert a value to the set. That's the dictionary. And we turn true if the set did not already exist in there, right? So, okay, if self.items dot get this value, right? If it already exists inside this dictionary, then we can just return a false. Otherwise, we want to set it here. So we'll say set um, self dot items dot value, and we'll just make that equal to some, any value is fine, true is good, and we'll return a true, because now that value exists. With remove, it's going to be the opposite, right? If the value mm, was inside the dictionary, and we pop it off, then we can return a true. So if self.items.getval, that means it exists inside the dictionary. So let's pop that off. Use the pop method here and return a true. Otherwise, return false because it's not in here, so we can't pop it off. And finally, with the get random, I just used the random module, um, something called the random.choice, and we'll just return the, uh, the items, the keys, of this items, but we have to make this an iterable. So we'll have to make this a list and we want to return it. Okay, so let's see if that works. Null, true, false, true, two, true, false, two. So it returned two instead of one, but I'm guessing that's just a thing with the random module here. So let's try some of that and see if we get accepted and we do get accepted. So yeah, luckily you can just use the dictionary. You don't need to have a list um, with some other languages. You might need to do that, but luckily Python already has a lot of methods for you to use to do this.